I don't even want us to see ask why. Ozzy just question. Ask see, why. see I don't want um I don't want um anybody to ask Ozzy, Ozzy question. Anything about him and Victoria friendship. I don't want it. No need. Even if Why people are going to be asking him, that stupid question. See, wait, no need to ask that question. It's none of my business. The person where me I get issue with now, Victoria. Because that girl is acting like the victim. She's acting clueless. Like I said, she's innocent. She's acting innocent. And I waited a verse with that. She's not innocent. She said a lot and she did a lot on that show. She did a lot. So even if we ask her and she did not answer the question, at least it will change a lot of people's mindset. But if you now want to behave as if she's the victim, then we said go tell and say you can have the victim. So because you can't really be... apologize. Then why are you exactly. like Exactly, she's not the victim. Like, yes, she should stop in? trying to like that girl. She they act, she they do pity pity stuff. Hi guys, welcome to my channel once again. How are you all doing today? Guys, like I keep telling you, you can trust me to bring you the gist updates, happenings, and all the buzzwords happening in and out of Big Brother Ninja House. Yes, guys, a lot happened while your faves were in Big Brother's house, and a lot is also happening now that your faves are outside Big Brother's Ninja house. Guys, it may seem as though Onyeka fans, they don't want to hear from what has happened between Onyeka and Victoria in Big Brother Ninja House. Yesterday again, yesterday night again, this set of us made the open space to drag Victoria. The open space to drag Victoria. Guys, before I continue with this, you see this, this is Verify this blog. If you are new to my channel, you are welcome. Thank you for stopping by. This is the place to be. And if you are also to this channel also, oh my god, you are welcome. Thank you for always stopping by. I see your comments. I see your likes. I see your share. I see all you do for me. Thank you guys. I love you all. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate. I appreciate. Honestly, I'm grateful. So guys, hmm. Onyeka and Victoria. Though, interview that Toke Makewa and Ebuka did for Victoria and Unika at the same time surfaced online this morning. And in that particular interview, Victoria still tells the fact and the reason why she did not uh, accept that apology that Unika apologized in Big Brother's house. According to her, she feels that the apology is not genuine because Ozzy came to meet her like two times that she, Onyeka wants to have conversation with her. Onyeka is seeing her in the house every day. Every day in Big Brother's house, she greets Onyeka good morning in the morning. Onyeka will not be like, Victoria, let's talk about what happened. No, rather Onyeka will climb stage when they have speech in Big Brother's house and be like, Victoria, forgive me. So she felt, according to Victoria, she, Victoria said she felt that those apologies that was coming from Onyeka at that point, that day they had that dinner in Big Brother's house was not genuine. That's the reason why she did not accept that apology. And she also stated the fact that she is out of Big Brother's house now. Victoria is out of Big Brother's house. Victoria said she has watched the clip. She has heard what people have to say. She watched the clip. She saw what Onyeka said about her. That she is not ready to mend things with Onyeka again. That everybody must not be friends. Everybody must not be friends. According to her, Onyeka should go a separate way. Meanwhile, she also will go a separate ways. Because what Onyeka said about her in Big Brother's Ninja house is not what somebody will say about Yeah, it was out of this world. Guys, you all saw it now. Whenever Onyeka wants to go to the diary session, it's, she's always singing Victoria's name from left, right, and center. Left, Victoria was the only thing in her mouth. So in reaction, in reaction to what Victoria said that her, the apology Onyeka apologized to her was not real, it was not genuine, that's why she did not accept. Onyeka reacted by making a speech to her. Onyeka was like, also too, everybody must not be friends like when her, Victoria said that she have tried her best. She have tried her best. She did what she did. And she's even saying it that she did what she did to remain in the house and what she did to remain in the house took her to the finals. So she hold no one apology at this point again. Since she has apologized to Victoria in Big Brother's house, and Victoria is still sitting down in her presence telling her that those apologies that Onyeka apologized are not genuine, that she herself she will close the road for friendship for now. But 
if Victoria feels the need for them to sit down and talk, if Victoria feels the need for the both of them to have a conversation, that she's open for conversation with Victoria any day, any time. Any time that Victoria will make up her mind, she is open for conversation. And that got a lot of persons talking. They are like, Victoria, thank God you did not accept that apology that she apologized on the stage right there because it was not a genuine apology we all saw it and we all experienced what happened everything she's been saying about you behind your backs so that particular apology she apologized to you that day is not genuine <laughs> guys how do you guys know it's not genuine no let me ask you now how do you know that this apologies when you apologized is not genuine me eh, i felt it's genuine apology let me tell you you know why because Onyeka did everything she did intentionally. Yes, she did everything. She played all the games she played with Victoria intentionally. Her intention was to go viral. Her intention was to be the, you know, talk of the town, talk of the show. That was her intention. So she realized that, you know, everything has come to an end. She realized that the show is over. Hence the reason why she did what she did and came back to apologize just a few days to the end of the show. Because she knows the show is over and what she has said uh, about Victoria is waiting for her outside. So she needed Victoria's genuine forgiveness. She needed forgiveness from Victoria before they step outside Big Brother's house. So that when Victoria finally see what she has said about her, she will not uh, take it to heart. She will just be like, anyway, she did what she did and she has... You know, apologize. But Victoria being this smart girl, she noticed it. She knew the game Monica is playing. She was like, yo, I've had you, but let me go outside and watch clips. And she have watched clips. She have heard what people got to say. Family and friends have advised Victoria to please stay away from Onyeka forever and right now Victoria is saying that she has finally closed this in short no conversation that she don't want to even have any conversation with Onyeka again because if Onyeka really wanted to have conversation with her she would have already done that in the house that this particular friendship is closed for now but Onyeka is saying she is still open to talk to Victoria anytime she like guys hi somehow all because of Ozi and all because of strategy. It's not because of Ozi, Ozi, Ozi. This is also strategy. Strategy is evolved here because Onyeka strategized the whole thing. She capitalized on this triangle and turned it to a strategy and it worked for her. Anyways, it is what it is. Now, Onyeka's friends are dragging Victoria. You heard what they are saying that Victoria is the one that is not accepting apology. Now, what is she feeling like? Onyeka has apologized. What, she's, what is she feeling like? Meanwhile, Victoria is saying she's not interested. She don't want any apology from Onyeka. And it is what it is. Mm? Nobody can force her to accept any apology from Onyeka. All right, guys. Thank you for joining me once again. Please, now, please click on the subscribe button. When you do so, please turn on the notification bell. I'll be notified in time I post new video for your pleasure. Thank you. Guys. I love you. Peace out.